Breaking news, the first snowstorm of 2017 causing huge problems in the high country. I-70 is shut down in both directions near Georgetown and Silverthorne. Loveland Pass is closed too. Bertha Pass just reopened in the last 30 minutes. Denver 7's Adam Hammond kicks off our team coverage tonight on I-70. Adam? Traffic is sitting still here on I-70 westbound in Silver Plume. It is on the other side of the interstate, too, after a semi-truck got into a nasty crash right here westbound. It lost control, tried to drive up one of those ramps, but went over the embankment down into eastbound I-70, hit two other cars. Luckily, there were no serious injuries, but there's a mess up there. There's pipes from that semi-truck everywhere, and 500 feet of guardrail was taken out because of that crash. They're working to clean up all of that right now. This line here should be moving in about any minute now, maybe 10, 15 minutes we're hearing from CDOT. But the eastbound lanes, a different story. They're expecting that to be sitting still like this much longer. Now we're hearing Loveland Pass was an alternate because of conditions. You can see it's snowing here just a little bit, but up on Loveland Pass, let's take a live shot of that. We can see blowing snow. There's fog up there. Just bad situations for driving. Also, Berthoud Pass had to be closed because of a crash, a multi-car crash. That has since been cleaned up, and it has reopened. As you can tell, this is the first we've seen snow. It's starting to fall just a little bit right here at Silver Plume. Mike Nelson, let's check in with him. I know he's going to tell us there's much more to come.